where we are and we are going to take it up for a little bit because I just want to do a little soft flight here to check it out check out the motors check out the battery and that's about all we're going to be doing <laughs> okay so I really got some other things I need to do today but I want to at least get this up in the air for a couple of minutes It's awfully. Yeah, that Monroeville airport, that thing's been closed for years. It is awfully sunny out here, man. So I'm expecting some serious glare. What I'm doing is watching the battery. Okay, so that's what I'm doing. Let's see what kind of flight time I'm getting. I want to get out of this battery. See if it's damaged at all. It's dropping. I don't know if it's quick, but it's going down. Okay. So I imagine there's probably a cell in here that ain't that hot but we're gonna see what kind of flight time I'm gonna get out of this thing I'm not gonna push this thing until I get this other battery and get that going seems to be pretty nimble so It just has that hum to it whenever you push up on the throttle like that. Okay, so I'm down to 80% and it's been going three minutes. So, I think they're having some kind of party or some kind of event over there at the park, so... I'm not going to be flying over them at all.
Landing gear lower. Okay, this little button here brings down the gear. You can fly it with the gear down too. So Landing gear raising. Lose the altitude there a little bit. Okay, so I'm down to 71% on the battery. Yeah, they're definitely having a party over there. I can see them setting up all this stuff. Okay, video's been going for five minutes. And... It's down to 67%. So for 30, down to 30% would be 10 minutes, so. I mean, don't forget this is that 4,000 milliamp hour battery. This isn't the 5,000. The one I bought is the 5,000, 5,700 or whatever it is. Not this small. I didn't buy another one of these 4,700s, so. And then of course I can charge it a few more times too because if you look in here in these settings at the battery, it says on there times charge zero. So this this thing was new. And they seem to be discharging here pretty evenly. So and are all at 3.7 or 1.369. 376 the cells so they're all pretty close you know I told you guys that I didn't think this thing was refurbished I thought it was new so and I still think it is I like it man I like it Ain't gonna be no hand catching on this. I'd like to see, I'd like to see Dobo. You know, he's like one of the kings of hand catching laser beams. So, I'm sure you could do it, but I seen him catch that one coming at him like 25 miles an hour. I was like, wow. Even I won't do that. So that was pretty, uh, pretty brave on Ken's part to, uh, Try that out. Let me see what this looks like with this camera pointed down. Okay, the yaw speed or the tilt speed is too high. So I'm gonna have to adjust that. Oh yeah, it flies nice, man. No issues at all so far. The video looks very clear on the on the screen here. Yeah, I definitely got to adjust that speed. All right, guys, we're going to wrap it up here. I'm going to bring it back over. Yeah, that's a party. I see balloons. That's what they're sporting over there. They're having a party.
Yeah, you see when I go up on it, it once it gets past a certain spot, it just goes up real fast. So the, you know, the camera goes up very fast. So I'm gonna have to find some kind of setting in there to, uh, to get rid of that, no doubt. All right, guys, I'm gonna cut the video. So we're at the 37% battery and I got 10 minutes out of it. So I should be able to get about 12 minutes. And that was on the first charge. You know, once I start charging it, break the battery in, it should be get, should get a little bit better. So we're gonna land it up. Very happy with the first flight. Very happy. All right, boys, there you go. <laughs> Inspire 1 V2. Have a nice day.